I'm at Greenwich. I'm heading towards the Tall Ship Festival. I'm just going to give you a panoramic view of where I am. Now that's where I've just come from, from the DLR on the train station. And all I'm going to do is turn to my left, past the Cuddy Sharp, towards the tank. And beside the Cuddy Sharp, I'm looking at the Gypsum Moth public house. And just turn around. <laughs> I'm just going to continue forward beside the Thames. Don't build it in front, it's the entrance to the footbridge which crosses over Twilight Gardens, the other side of the Thames. We'll be going down there shortly, but first I'm going over beside the Thames. Beside the entrance to the foot tunnel, which crosses over to Island Garden. from the lift there, which is taking me from the foot tunnel, and I'm on Island Gardens now, and we're heading back up towards the Thames. I've just come from there, the foot tunnel, but all I'm going to do now, I'm going to head over towards the Thames, and take a few more shots of these tall ships, and after that we're going to head along the Thames towards Tower Bridge. I do not like what they do. I'll be leaving Island Gardens there on my way and we'll be heading up to Canary Wharf. I've just come through those gates there. And all I'm going to do now is just continue straight. Okay, I've just come down from there. Okay. And in front, we've got the Garden Island Docklands Light Railway Station. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to turn to my left and just continue straight up West Ferry. Okay, when you reach this point, we're going to turn left towards the Thames Path again. Okay, when you get to the ferry house, all we do is turn to our right and just continue.
So let's continue straight. Let's continue straight. On this point on the Thames path, we leave because it's a dead end up in front. So we have to turn right here and continue round to rejoin the Thames again. Okay, that's where we come from where we left the Thames path. And all we do now is just continue straight in front till we get onto the road. Press ferry and return to our left, heading up to Canary Wharf. And that's where it came from. Now you've got the same post here, and all you do, as I said, return left and just carry on straight. Okay, we're nearly at Canary Pier, or Canary Wharf. Just continue straight up this hill. Okay, when you get to this point, beside Cuba Street, and the same post, point to the Thames path, we turn left here, and head back onto the Thames path. That's where I come from, Cuba Street, and there. And all we do is just continue along the Thames path here. Just, just continue straight. Okay, here we are now at Canary Wharf. Now you can get a free boat ride on the Hilton Ferry across to the other side. It's a small boat. But anyway, from here, what we're going to do, we're just going to continue straight in front, and as I said, we're heading towards Tower Bridge. Just carry on straight. Okay, I've just come from here. From there, sorry. And all we do now is just continue straight in front, heading towards Narrow Street. So ignore the turn in there on the left. So just continue straight in front. Okay, I've just come out from there, Dunbar Wharf. And as I said, we're going to turn left along Narrow Street and continue straight beside the Thames. So we just continue straight in front. Okay, I'm standing outside the Grapes, one of the historic pubs along Narrow Street. I've just passed the Grapes Public Coast, all we do is continue straight. Okay, we'll just wait for the crossings to... We just continue, and we're going to go down beside the narrowboat pub, which is in front. Now that's where I've just come from, and as I said, we're going to go down beside the Bower Boat to see where those people are going, and we'll be joining the Thames Path again, heading all the way to Tower Bridge. Let's give you a little view of where I am. So we just go ahead, down the steps, and back onto the Thames Path. Okay, I'm beside the narrow boat here. I'll just give you a little view. Okay, we just left the Thames Path there. And all we do now is just continue on till we rejoin it again. 
On, on my right here, in front, you've got the entrance to the Wotherhive Tunnel on Spurt Street. Entrance to the Wotherhive Tunnel. Okay, when you get to this part of the road, all you do is just continue straight in front where those cyclists are going. Just give you a view where we are. Okay, so all we do is just continue straight in front here. Just continue straight on, we're back on the Thames path. Just continue straight. Just continue round. Uh, that's where I've just come from. Keep your family beside the children's playground, and all we do is just continue straight in front. Okay, I've just come from out there, over there, by the park, and here we are by Shadwell Basin. And what all we're going to do is just go over the bridge and carry on to Wappen High Street. So we just continue straight in front. Okay, in front we've got the Prospect of Whitney, frequented by Charles Dickens, High Witch Rogues, you name it. This was a notorious, well, den of iniquity. And behind the Prospect of Whitney, beside the Thames, and beside me is the noose where pirates are said to have hung. Just continue straight. When you reach this point off the road, just turn left. Okay, we'll be passing Wappen here, Wappen Station. And now all we do is just continue straight in front. We'll be passing the Captain Kidd Public House. He was a pilot who was hung. Anyway, we just carry on straight. Beside the Captain Kidd Public House, on the other side of the road, is the Wapping Rose Gardens here, so just give you a little view. Anyway, what we're going to do is just carry along straight. I've just come out of the Rose Garden, we just carry on straight. Another notorious pub on the Wapping High Street. And beside the Wappen Old Stairs, and this is where they used to <coughs> take prisoners for, um, <coughs> let's put it like this, sent to the colonies. They're taken down here onto a boat and onto the ships. Just continue straight. Okay, when you get to this point, all we do is turn to our left up the stairs and along the Thames Path again where we're going to be coming up by St. Catherine's Dock and uh, Tower Bridge, where the jog ends. Get a little view where I am. So we're going to turn left here, up the steps. Right, I've just come up the steps, I'm in the gardens here. I believe it's Heritage Gardens. Anyway, we just continue to the end and we're heading for St. Catherine's Dock. Okay, I've just come through those gardens there and left there by the gate there. And all we do is just continue along here, Wappen High Street, and bear to our left. We come towards St. Catherine's Stop and Tower Bridge, where the jog ends. We just continue straight along here, St. Catherine's Way. I continue along here, St. Catherine's Way, ignore all the signs saying onto the Thames Path, just continue straight in front. 
Okay, bed to your right and then left between the two buildings there. So we're heading into St. Catherine's Stock. As I said, we just turn up here between the two buildings by Marble Q. I'm in St. Catherine's Stock. Again, fun is Dickens in. Now, if you want to go back up to Tower Bridge, all you do is there's a bridge over there, you cross over it, and you go along the other side, round, and there's a subway, and it takes you all the way up to Tower Bridge or Tower Hill Station. But anyway, what I'm going to do, I'm just going to continue round in front, and we're coming out by the Tower Bridge or Tower of London. And that's where I've just come from, and I'll just give you a little panoramic view of St. Catherine's Stock. Anyway, we're just going to continue straight in front. So what I'm going to do is cross over the bridge and head over there towards Tar Bridge. Okay, we're coming to the end of the jog now. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to cross 
Tower Bridge and I'm going to head up to um, London Bridge. So anyway, this is the end of the job. I'm underneath, or beside, Tower Bridge. Now if you go through here, you come up by Tower of London. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to go up the steps there onto the bridge and across over to the other side and heading towards London Bridge. I've just come up the steps and I'm on Tower Bridge now. And across the one looking at me is Tower of London. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to cross Tower Bridge and go down onto the other side. I'm heading towards London Bridge. So we just go ahead here. Right, that's where I'm heading for towards the short London Bridge. I'm going to lift down onto Queen's Walk from Tower Bridge. Just give you a look. Okay, I've just got out of the lift there, which took me down from Tower from the top of Tower Bridge down to the Queen's Walk, and all we do now is just continue walking straight and we're heading towards London Bridge. City Hall, we just continue straight in front. HMS Belfast, which is more here beside City Hall or near City Hall. Okay, when you get to the Hayes Galleria, all we do is turn to our left into it and we're heading out into Tooley Street and beside Liverpool, sorry, London Bridge Station. As I said, we turn left into here, the Hayes Galleria, and we bear to our right and we're heading out towards Tooley Street towards London Bridge Station. Okay, this is where it all ends for me, the jog ends. And beside London Bridge, under the ground station, and in front, we've got the Shard. Okay, just give you a little panic when I'm through where I am. Now, if you take that turn in there, it goes right underneath London Bridge, and it takes you out beside Suffolk Cathedral and Bower Market. But anyway, this is the end of the jog, I hope you enjoyed it. It was really just a sightseeing job, but anyway, I hope you enjoyed it.